Hello everyone, it's Glenda and welcome back to my channel, Creative Grandma. I hope everyone is having a happy crochet or knitting day. Well, this video is all about crochet kits. Now, I just done a crochet kit for a doll for another company and I was contacted by a different company and they asked me if I would enjoy doing a review of one of their kits and I thought, well, sure, I love to crochet and I'd be happy to see their product, try it out, and let everyone know what I think. Now, this kit is supposed to be for a beginner. So I did not look at the kit. This is the adorable kit. It comes in a beautiful box. I was very impressed. So if you know a crocheter who wants to learn how to make amigurumi or some really cute little things, you may enjoy this kit or some of the other ones they have to offer. Now, I don't know how to say this company's name. I'm going to hold the paper up. It's KD. A-F-I-O. So you can go to the website. I'm going to hold this up. Now my blue ink didn't print. It's www.kdafio.com. So I went to their website and I chose a little gingerbread man kit because I thought with the holidays coming, he was just so cute. And it came in this adorable box. And it has a see-through window where you can see him sticking out just a little bit. Let me hold that up there. Can you see the little gingerbread? And it even says, wonderful gift. It's just a cute little box. Now, I'm always telling everybody I'm having trouble with my lighting. So I'm going to put this over on the table so I can put the camera down when I open the box. And we can review everything in the box. I'll tell you the price and I'll give you some more information. But it's my first time getting a kit from this company. So it's always exciting to learn what these companies are all about. So let's go ahead and take a look at what's in the box. So here's the box, an up close look. And it says perfect for beginners. So let's open the box and let's take a look at what comes inside. Well, the first thing you're going to see is it says Gingerbread Man, Merry Christmas. And this is what I'm going to make. So I'm going to open it up. I'm going to take a peek inside. Now, the first thing I'm seeing is a QR code to view the tutorials for the video. Now, the only thing I don't like about QR codes is if you give this to someone who doesn't have a cell phone. And yes, there's still a lot of people that don't have cell phones. So if you don't have a phone to use the QR code, then I'm not sure if there's another way that you can watch the video. And then it's showing you the terminology of what they're talking about in the pattern so you can refer to the terminology. Part three, the instructions to make your very own doll. And then it goes into how to read the pattern. And here's the stitches and abbreviations. So I'm just gonna show you a couple lines of the instructions. Now the instructions are written in a way that I'm not used to. They're pretty basic instructions, but usually for a beginner, you would really wanna write out more detailed instructions to make it very clear of what they're supposed to do. Now I'm seeing a single crochet, I'm seeing a slip stitch, I'm seeing increases, so you must know at least your basic stitches, how to increase and probably how to decrease. And then I see on the back they have a little bit of photos and then it shows you to make the arms, the hat, and then the instructions go on to show you all the pieces. And then again, if you have any trouble, it's referring you to the video. So let's look at this next book. It says, do it yourself, handcrafts, crochet kit for beginners. So this might, this does give you a lot more information. It's telling you the abbreviations that are used in the pattern. It's telling you which hook do I use for which weight of yarn. It gives you the conversion from UK to the US. Now it's showing you how to hold the yarn. Now, I don't hold my yarn that way. Everybody learns how to hold their yarn a different way, depending on who has taught them how to crochet. It also goes into working into a chain, working in the round. So it is explaining how you're going to work in the round. So that's good. It explains the pattern a little bit more. It's showing you how to make a magic ring, how to do the single crochet, how to single crochet two together. 
the slip stitch, the half double crochet, half double crochet two together, the double crochet, double crocheting two together. It's showing you how to change colors, working into which loop, working straight, working into a space, and fastening off. So all kinds of information, nice little book. So again, they have that QR code that you can scan to get the tutorial. So they really need to consider people who don't have a phone. So I'm going to set that aside and let's take a look at what's in the kit itself. So I see a whole package of little stuff right here. So let's go ahead and open it up. So they give you the crochet hook. So that's nice if you don't have a crochet hook. And I'm not sure what this is. It looks like some wire. And these are two little white pom-poms. And they give you an extra one, I believe, because I only see one pom-pom on the gingerbread man's hat. So they give you an extra one. That's nice. I'm seeing some butterflies. I'm not sure where these go. I'm not seeing them on the gingerbread man anywhere. I do see the little um, poinsettia in here. So I'm not sure what those butterflies are for. Oh, I, I think it's a, a needle threader. Put them back in there. That's unusual. And then this is the little decoration that goes on the hat. So they include that. That's nice. And then here's some, what I want to say, straight pins. I got a glue stick. Now this little bag of stuff here, I see they give me four safety eyes in case I mess up. So they give you that extra set of safety eyes. So I'm just going to put them back in that little bag so I don't lose them. I'm seeing stitch markers and then the backs of the safety eyes and then two yarn needles, which I'm glad they give you extra. I'm always losing my yarn needles. I have a lot, but I can never find them when I want them. So that's what comes in the accessory package. So here's the yarn for the project. They have it balled up in the amounts that you need. Doesn't look like very much. I hope it's enough. So I'm seeing the gingerbread color. I'm seeing red for the hat, white for the trim. And the black, I'm not sure. Oh, the black is for the mouth, the little embroidery for the mouth, the green for the bow tie, and the little pink, I think, is for his cheeks. And then also inside the bag is the stuffing. So I can't help it. I have to open this stuffing and see what happens. They have it vacuum packed. <laughs> <laughs> and then you can see how it really puffs up after you open that bag. So it's always funny when you see some of this stuff vacuum packed. So you get your stuffing, you get your yarn, you get all the accessories in the accessory pack, you get the instructions, and you get the do-it-yourself handcrafts crochet kit for beginners guidebook. So that is everything in the kit. Now this kit costs $19.95. Now I'm not sure what the shipping is because this was shipped to me free so I could do an unboxing and show you the kit. So let me show you the website and let me show you some of the other kits they have available. And then after I show you the website, I'll show you the finished gingerbread man because this is the magic of doing videos because I can pause the video, make the gingerbread man, and come right back. So let's go ahead and take a look at their website. So I'm over on their website, and the first thing that's going to show up on your screen is subscribe to get a discount code. So if you put your email address in there, click the green banner right here, then you're going to get a code to get a discount off your order. Now it's not telling me what the discount would be, but you could find that out. Now, right now, I'm under the Christmas Crochet Kit. This is the gingerbread kit that I just showed you. You're going to see Little Crochet Snowman. I'm going from left to right. The Gingerbread Man. Santa Claus. Another Gnome Santa Claus. A Little Christmas Tree. They have a Reindeer. And this next one is a Candy Cane Christmas a Christmas wreath, and another Christmas wreath. 
And then down here you can see some featured reviews. Here's that little gingerbread man. I thought he was really cute. And the person who ordered it tells you what they think of the kits. And they rated the kits by five stars or however many stars they thought of the kits. So again, this is K-D-A-F-I-O. That's the name of the company. It says free shipping worldwide over $45. It says shop. And it says, view all, best sellers, all kits, bundles, accessories, almost gone, Christmas, all kits. I'm going to hit on all kits. Just show you a few of them. Again, here are some Christmas. I see some flowers. I see some little animals. So hopefully you can see these kits okay. I'm just going to briefly scroll down over them. They did have a little bunny. I got to see if I can find them because I almost chose the bunny. So here is the little bunny kit. I just thought he was so cute. So here is the bunny kit. Now the bunny kit's a little less expensive. It's only $14.99. They have the little elephant for $9.99. And again, these are the beginner kits. And you can take your time and scroll down through everything they have to offer. I will put a link to their website in the description box underneath the video. Now this is not an affiliate link. I don't get paid whether you buy these kits or you don't buy the kits this video is for your information of what these kits are like to give you an inside view of what you're really getting for your money so this is the name of the company again in bright rainbow letters it says it was born from the passion and courage of our founder Jane Jane is an experienced crochet artist who has been exploring and developing new crocheting techniques, designing stunning patterns over years, and sharing her knowledge and experience with crocheting enthusiasts worldwide. Now there's no information of where this company is based, so I did email them and I did ask them. I said I don't see any information of where you're based. They are based in China. And you can read more information about the company. So now since I showed you a little bit about what's on their website, I'm going to show you what the finished gingerbread man looks like and what I thought of the actual instructions and if I had any trouble making the little gingerbread man. So let's take a look. So I'm back. It's been two days. It took me two days to make my little gingerbread man. So I thought he'd come out so stinking adorable. I just thought it was so much fun to learn how to make him. And I'm just now getting into how to make dolls and how to make little characters and it was really fun I have to say so here's the picture now mine I crochet really tight and stiff this come out a little too stiff so this was supposed to bend down like this but mine doesn't but I kind of like it up in the air like a dunce cap so I like it this way I thought he'd come out cute now the only thing I didn't do was the candy cane I didn't make the candy cane because I didn't want the candy cane on my gingerbread man. If you're a confident beginner where you know how to single crochet, how to increase a simple increase and a simple decrease, then you could make this kit very easily. But you must know your stitches in order to do this and you must know how to read a pattern or follow along with the tutorial. Now the only issue I think a beginner would have is with this little bow tie. They're using double, triple stitches for the bow tie. And if you can't figure it out from the crochet tutorial, then you could just probably buy a pre-made bow. But I thought it was so much fun learning how to make him. And I always shied away from making characters and dolls and now I'm having a lot of fun. Now remember, I cannot do video tutorials on other company designs, that's copyright. All I can do is show you my results, how it looks, what I thought of the kit, and again, if you are a confident beginner and you know those basic stitches of a single crochet, this is mostly single crochet, and then the bow tie is a double, triple stitch. So most of it is just plain single crochet, and then you need to know how to increase or decrease. 
Now, there may be a couple situations where you have to follow that video, like when you crochet the little legs, you crochet the legs, you crochet, I start in the back, I crochet around the leg, and then you stop, and then you put the next leg up next to it, and then you crochet around that leg, and then that forms the legs joining it to the body, and then you keep crocheting around. So if you're not familiar how to do that, you would probably have to watch the video. Everything else is pretty simple. You start at the legs, you work up to the neck, and then here's the neck. You just decrease, you get smaller, and then you start increasing again for the main part of the head, and then you decrease up to the top of the head up here. And then the same with the arms, you start at the base of the arms and you just increase and then single crochet an even number until you make the little arms. And then you just sew them right here across the top. Very simple, you go through those stitches and right through the neck. And then for the hat, same thing, you start up here at the top and then you just keep increasing and increasing until your hat is done. You attach the safety eyes, you embroider your little mouth and cheeks on, and it's just a fun project if you always wanted to learn how to do amigurumi or little characters. And the nice thing is you can keep the little booklet with the pattern, and then you can remake it using your own stash if you want to have a little family of these characters. So I hope you enjoyed this video, seeing my little gingerbread man I made and seeing what some of these kits are all about that you can purchase online. Now I'll have a link directly to Daffio's website and this is not an affiliate link so it doesn't matter if you buy the kit or you don't buy the kit. This video was for information purposes only. So thank you everybody for stopping by and until next time, stay inspired and happy crocheting. Bye everyone.